Hey there, it's me, Natalie Tucker Miller, founder of Ageless Sages Publishing, and I'm here with another little communication story with elders. And this happened a few years ago with a friend of mine who lived in a nursing home, and she was watching uh, at, a, at a pretty rapid rate. A lot of her friends were, were passing, and it was kind of getting to her. So she kind of got into this um, idea that she, you know, her time was coming. She was, it was, she was getting close to dying. And uh, I was observing some of the reactions to that, as she would say to someone, I'm going to die soon. And a typical response might be, I don't know what my response might you come up with, uh, probably maybe similar to what other people were saying, which was, oh, that's not true, or, oh, you're going to live forever, or, oh, don't say that, or ignoring it altogether. It, that probably was the more common one. It was just not even not even addressing it. So I thought, hmm, let me put my coaching listening hat on and see what, what I can see. So I sat down with her, and eventually the conversation did turn to, I'm, I'm going to die soon, you know. And... Um, so I just acknowledged that, that that's, oh, that's, so you feel like you're going to die soon. And that's all I said. And she went on to really bring up some of her, maybe some closure things. She reminisced a bit. She uh, really found some peace in having this conversation. I think it was the conversation she was really waiting to have. And then she paused a minute and looked at me and said, but I'm going to get a perm first. <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> I think we should all get a perm before we go. Uh, real wisdom in that. And I, I so appreciated the fact that I was at a point where I was able to just listen to her and hear her because it seemed like it did do her some good. I didn't hear conversations after that about her dying. She got out what she needed to get out and she was satisfied with the fact that when the time came, she would know and she'd get a perm first. So I hope that helps. I hope that helps you find some comfort and ease in communicating with elders. Thanks for listening.